Oh, ain't it lucky that we don't know when things begin? Oh, just exactly how it all is gonna end. They tell you reach for the stars. Just believe and you'll go far. That's what they're selling. But I'm here and I'm telling you, I just can't win. Live from uh, on air. <laughs> from station GHRT in the Griffin Heart Studios, it's the really big old time radio medicine show. That's what that's one of the new songs on the Did you recognize it? No. Oh yeah. Oh, I thought that was an old I'll song. I'll sing a little No? Oh you thought you thought who did, whose song did you think it was? Hank Williams? No. Who? I don't know, just like some monk song, you know. <laughs> we don't have too much it? on the roster tonight, Ma. It's just one girl has wrote in, she wants to know what is love. What is love? And then, uh, of course, we got the weight loss people. Yeah, a few weight loss people. So, we'll, gi- we'll give you the, uh, g- we'll scare you skinny. Scare you skinny. Yeah. Watch this show. You'll be scared skinny. And um, get rich. Yeah. And if we got the time, we'll put in the meaning of life and formula of happiness. Sounds good. Sounds like a good show. Sounds like a real good show, daddy O. Are you in a G there? No. I was oh. in an E, sorry. What were you in? E. That's oh, okay, I can do E. You can do E? I gotta go real slow, I gotta play bass. Oh, ain't it lucky that we don't know when things begin? Oh, just exactly how it all is gonna end. I know who wrote this song. <laughs> <laughs> they tell you, reach for the stars. Just believe. You go far. You're supposed to go to the seventh there. Sorry. Well, <laughs> that's what they sa- tell you, but I'm here to tell you, I just can't win. This is the, this is the, this is the big part. This is the chorus. <laughs> And you wrote it. So I bring that out, hit the bar, and I get my buzz. And I become the country star that never was. <laughs> is, that, is that not how it goes, Dad? It's too yeah. bad. <laughs> I started halfway through. <laughs> Better sing that song. Okay. That's the songwriting part of the show. Oh, no. You know what it is? All right. What is I it? got it. All right. Too much deceiving. Too much leaving. Too much because. You know that dream ain't going down. It never does. So every night I hit the bar and I get my buzz. And I become the country star that never was. That's pretty good. Yeah, real good. I, I checked like it. it. There was, it had two verses. Mm-hmm. But I checked the second one out. I got to do it again. Mm. Because it's deserving of reasonable yeah. lyrics. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Should we take a ride, Dad? Should we yep. take a ride? All right, ladies and gentlemen, step outside the door to your mind, because there's an old black Cadillac limo waiting just outside, and we're going to take a ride. We're going to take a ride. We're going to take a ride. I pass the city limits. I do the honky tonk. Uh, through the honky tonk and past the county line. In the county line. Through the amber waves of rain. Through those waves of rain. That's the old dairy cows. Uh, with the big brown eyes. Oh, with the big brown eyes. Mm, down the country road. Ba, 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 ba. It's a dusty old road. Ah, the girlies, too. Oh, they're hanging out of the window. 
Somebody says, great big old tower, station GHRT. Station GHRT, it's there for you and me. And it's brought to you by Alice's Restaurant. You can get anything you want down at Alice's Restaurant. Anything you want. Anything you want. Alice's Restaurant. At a restaurant. We're going to go in the um, old station there into the front desk and see Betty Page. Yeah. Get our special tea. I think it's got that CBD in it. I've been hearing a lot I about the CBD. Might, yeah. I would and like to try some of that. Maybe it's got some of the THC in it, too. Could that, that's optional. They're uh, supposed to be killing cancer like crazy with that. Mm. Yes, yeah, sir, Barbarino. And she's going to send you on downstairs here to the Broiler Room Studios for the really big old-time radio medicine show. Three Chords and the Truth, starring Molly Griffin and her old dog, Doo, and the Reverend Dr. Joey G, too, coming to you live from Station GHRT in the virtual haystack in your mind, where the show always starts in five minutes. And we don't spin the tunes on the turntable, we spin them on our souls. So kick back, chill out, and relax to the mellow sounds of the singing DJs. <laughs> <laughs> Spin them on our arseholes. Spin them on our souls. What do you got for us, Dad? What is love? Baby, don't hurt me. I don't know how much people should face the truth. <laughs> That's the problem that I got. Mm-hmm. It's easy for somebody to stand here and look at another person and say, just face yourself. Yeah. Just face the role model that you are to your the children around you. You know, talking about weight. But how much can people take? How much can they And take? how much should they? Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Because it really gets down to facing. Yeah. If you stay there and just face it and face it until it freaks you out, <laughs> fear yeah. will motivate you. Mm-hmm. And another key, key item in, in the weight loss thing is quit shitting yourself. Quit doing all the, don't watch <laughs> Dr. Oz and all the things that you do that make you think you're, you're adhering to, yeah. to getting the job done are bullshit. Yeah. They're tr- trying to trick your head, but your head knows you're not doing it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And that's where it gets down to facing the truth. You know, so just quit all that. Yeah. Take it to a bottom. Take it to and, a and, bottom. And expect it to be really, really take tough, too. Take it to a bottom. It used to take me three hours take at the beginning, the whole gym trip. Three hours. Three hours. But, you know, I did make uh, $100 million take it to and a lost 70 pounds. 70 pounds? 70. Take it to Might a have bottom. been 68. Take it to a bottom. I hope it wasn't 58. Was take it 58, eh? No. No. Or not. Oh, that's a, a weight. Yeah. We need love songs. We got a girl in here mm-hmm. wants to know what is love. Well, love really has to do with evolution. Mm-hmm. Because important. procreation, survival and procreation mm-hmm. are the insurance mm-hmm. that Mother Nature takes yeah. to making sure that we're evolving. Yeah. And boy, she gets really serious. Is there anything more serious in life than uh, sex and romance and reproducing? And then after you got that job done, how freaky people get about their offspring? Yeah. Can you see? Yeah. That's, you know, most of it is right there. Yeah. And those two things. Yeah. <sighs> got so excited, I, I forgot what I was talking about. <laughs> what is love? What is love? <laughs> Correct. <laughs> Correct the mundo. Well, love is your like inner inner self. It, you know, it ends up in the pet, uh, what do they call it? The petit more? Yeah. The egg and the the little the death. Th- it, well, that's like really heavy. So you got this real real inner thing just really compelling you. Yeah. So when the right DNA for you or whatever, it, it's more than just DNA because uh, you know the whole brain is at work. Mm-hmm. Making choices. Yeah. Then you, uh, you, your mind responds in kind. Mm-hmm. It pushes you, and then it gives you a kind of a paradise. Yeah. Uh, to get the job done. 
Yeah. And then you have to deal with the job. But what what the problem in our society is is Hollywood didn't show realistic enough. No. You know, they just show all the love. And the thing is, is of course, this love uh, creates a brain chemistry mm -hmm. that's probably maybe the most wonderful for most people that they ever had. Yeah. And so, of course, they want love songs because it trips it again. Keeps ah. it going. And that's amore. And I, there's one more thing I can <laughs> say. <of. laughs> no, it's important. This is important. Okay. Because you can see it in the tribes. That with fixed marriages. Yeah. It's your body telling you your immune system is actually what gives you that feeling that they talk about heart. Mm -hmm. That's actually your immune system. Yeah. And it's choosing a good mix uh, of DNA. Crazy. It's beyond what we can mm. conjure up rationally. Yeah. You know, they fix marriages dependent on w how much family money mm -hmm. each one's got and all that kind of stuff. Oh. Not good. No. That's not real good, no. No. Shouldn't be doing that. <laughs> Don't do that. Don't do that. Why do they do that? Why do they do that? <laughs> because that's amore. Do whatever you want. <laughs> no, don't. <laughs> yeah, Quit on. ruining my transition. <laughs> oh, are we singing that? <laughs> yeah. Cause oh, cause yeah. Because it's love. Because right? that's amore. Why is that too? Uh, too I don't know. Might be right. We used to do when the moon hits your eye like a big pizza pie, that's amore. Bells will ring, ting ling ling, ting ling ling. You're gonna know you're in love. You're gonna walk in a dream. No, you're not dreaming, see your way. School's on me, but you see, back in old Napoli, that's a Maury. School's on me, but you see, back in old Napoli, that's a Maury. When the stars seem to shine like you had too much wine that's more bells will ring ting a ling a ling ting a ling a ling you're gonna know you're in love you're gonna walk in a dream no you're not dreaming senior Schools of me, but you see, back in old Napoli, that's Maury. Schools of me, but you see, back in old Napoli, that's Maury. When the moon hits your eye like a big pizza pie, that's Maury. Ting a ling a ling, you're gonna know you're in love. You're gonna walk in a dream. No, you're not dreaming, senor. Screws on me, but you see, back in old Napoli, that's a more. Screws on me. But you see, back in old Napoli, that's a more. That's a more. <laughs> Ooh, back in old Napoli. Is that where they need to. That where. Wow. I'm re my dry after. My mouth is real dry. Uh, is that where they make the Neapolitan? Oh, I think. Neapolitan. Yeah. Napoli. No, it's different. No, different, different things. Different things are different. Getting rich there. is about obsessing on it. It doesn't take, you don't have to be really, really deep, anything like that. You've got to have some savvy, practicality, and then after that, it's just all obsession. All obsession. You know, uh, you know people have a 
for instance, the Russian Jews, yeah. everybody knows they're really good at it, right? Yeah. And they, they like to think, oh, they're just smarter than us. Mm -hmm. It's not. It's not. It's obsessing on it. Yeah, they're just focused on it's that. It's in the childhood. It's all the way up. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. That's why it should be in the schools. You know, Robert Kioski out there, he's a big dude on the, on the trailer about getting rich. Mm -hmm. And he's real, too. They've got to put it in schools. Mm -hmm. uh, it's about fair play. Mm -hmm. It's about getting everybody starting from the same spot on this stuff. They purposely don't tell you anything about any of this stuff in there. Yeah. It makes you easy kill, right? Easy prey. Yeah. For the people that do yeah. get taught about it. Yeah. That aren't really nice people if they're not. Yeah. <sighs> Did I tell you how to get rich? Yeah, you, you just got to obsess. obsess on it. Some people don't maybe don't know. But here, I'm not telling you to do it. Mm -hmm. Because when you start obsessing and you get into the puzzles, games, and stories, if you don't like them, the ones that are in there, and they hurt your brain and make you feel like a piece of shit, yeah. well, then it's not for you. Yeah. The most important thing is I am what I am. I'm all what I am, right? Yeah. Now let's play the game, all. The game I of know, all I'm games trying. within the show of all shows. Kick back and chill out to the mellow sounds of the singing DJs. Would you say this is a relax and chill show? Are we relaxed enough? I think so. We're trying. All right. Because it's that's a big, big market there. Yeah. Yeah. I'm taking it. Country <laughs> chill. Country chill. Man. Yeah. Good, Dad. <laughs> Country chill. <laughs> we need love songs. Oh, love songs. What do you got? Oh, okay. Oh, uh, you got something else? I thought we what were you talk got? talking about money. Well, this is the game. you got to pick the song that went with all the crap I said. Well, Country Club is about money and love. Country Club. <laughs> oh. Country Club. Travis Tritt. Travis Tritt. Travis yeah, Tritt. he's from a big family in the South, Travis. Yeah. Yeah. Used to work all around back down in the town that I built down there. Griffin, Georgia. Griffin, Georgia. Yeah. Well, you know, I'm like... Um, Patton, you know? Yeah. I can see into my other lives. Yeah, you were there. I can smell it. I can smell the cotton. Wish I was a land of cotton. Old time gone, but not forgotten. Look away. Oh, look away. Oh, look away. Old Dixie Lane. When I was a little bitty baby, my mama would have rocked me. back home It was down in Louisiana just about a mile from a Texarkana in them old cotton fields back home Alright, you took a double take It was down in Louisiana <laughs> just about a mile from Texarkana in them old Cotton fields back home. It was down <laughs> yeah. Louisiana, just, just about a mile from the Texarkana. In them old cotton fields back home. We better get out of here, Mom. Yeah. In them oh. old, old <laughs> cotton fields back home. <laughs> Oh, you surprised me with it, Mom. Well, you're supposed to go oh, into, I took a double take out. Oh, oh, is that what I was supposed to say? Yeah, you were listening. Oh, okay, <laughs> sorry, uh, Travis. Uh, <laughs> I took a double take out on the interstate, and I saw her making eyes at me. Oh, I followed her down to the clubhouse drive past the pool and the 18 green. Are we in a right in the parking lot, <laughs> says money. Oh, maybe I could buy you a beer. She said, I'm glad you asked, but I'm gonna have to pass. Cause, Cause only members are allowed in here. Hey, I'm a member of a country club. 
How many keys out were we on that? <laughs> About like I think a six? few. Yeah, maybe <laughs> four. <laughs> Mixing it up in you there just from it. one octave to another. You should have just talked it, Dad. Yeah. Well, it's five o'clock. Uh, yeah, it's on easy Friday to night. say it in hindsight, <laughs> but when you're the guy that's on the spot, you got to make it up, <laughs> and you got to talk about all this philosophical <laughs> stuff too. Hey, well, man, hold it, meaning it's life. Your idea. What does that mean to me? Is uh, that five? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, Hank. You're laughing at me. Keep those people back. Nervous hospital people are here again. Oh no, yeah. not again. Yeah, they've been known to throw things at me <laughs> because they think I should go with them. They're not throwing things at you. They're throwing things with you. Yeah, they're trying to coax me to come along with them because I'm sort of <laughs> like R.P. McMurphy, you know. <laughs> You, you dimwit. <laughs> well, I forget what he said. Uh, so, uh, very politically incorrect nowadays, anyway, I'll tell you. <laughs> <laughs> um, what's up now? Oh, I, I got one more to say. One don't more I? thing to say. Meaning of life. Meaning of life. Well, it, it, it's real good news on this. Uh-huh. Because somebody made the connection in the brain mm-hmm. about the whole Darwin thing, and they found out the, the uh, applied brain function is all about ev- evolution. Mm-hmm. And so now we know all we got to do is cooperate with our brain mm-hmm. because our brain uh, teaches us about uh, creating uh, a unique purpose of our own mm-hmm. that lives within the whole evolution of it. Mm-hmm. That's number one, purpose. Mm-hmm. Purpose and meaning, mm-hmm. number one. And if it's right, it'll have the development. Yeah. That's number two, keep it developing. Mm-hmm. Number three is fair play. Mm-hmm. Monkeys demand fair play, yeah. and we're a monkey. Yeah. Love and affection, connection yeah. to other living things. Mm-hmm. And paleo glasses were the same people we were 20,000 years ago. If you want to sleep, if you want to poop, you've got to register that in your head, mm-hmm. and you've got to get your life as close to that as possible, like a lot of people are, are mm-hmm. doing. Mm-hmm. 
Meaning of life. Secret and formula to happiness was right in there. Mm -hmm. I gave the whole checklist. Mm -hmm. There you go. Yeah. Show's mm -hmm. over. What's yeah. the song you got for that? The song we got for that is we got to do a big one, Dad. So. <laughs> Today I started loving you again. Oh, well I got to do the two of them then. Uh, okay. I can't stop. Is that the right key? <laughs> um, yeah, I think it is for that one. Oh, yeah, okay. Let's just go. I can't, I can't stop loving you. I said I made up my mind to live in memories a long time. R&B bluegrass. I can't, I can't stop wanting you. Oh, it's useless to say. So I'll just live my life. Dreams of yesterday. Dreams of yesterday. Those happy hours. Those happy hours. That we once knew. That we once knew. So long ago. So long ago. They still make me blue. Still make me blue. You know they say the time. They say the time. They hear the broken heart. Here's a broken heart Hey, but the time has stood still Years since we've been apart I can't stop loving you I said I made up my mind To live in memory Of the lonesome kind I can't stop wanting you You know it's useless to say So I'll just live my life Dreams of yesterday Dreams of yesterday Oh, I'll just live my life Dreams of yesterday Yesterday all my troubles seem so far away oh, Now it looks as though they're here to stay Oh, I believe in Merle Haggard <laughs> Today I started loving you again Now I'm right back Where I really always been I got over you just long enough to let my heart ache, man. And then today I started loving you again. Yeah, today I started loving you again. Oh, what a fool I was to think I could get by. to come and that crying time for me just begun and then today the I started loving you again and I'm right back where I really always been hey I got old Let my heart ache, man And then today I started loving you again And then today I started loving you again And then today I started loving you again
I didn't call him that. I just called him Merle. My uncle's name was Merle. 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 He was kind of haggard, but that wasn't his name. No. <laughs> <laughs> just a little dog's kind of haggard, too. He was haggard. Oh, no, it was Hagrid, right? Yeah. yeah. Anyway, there you have it. What was it all? How to lose weight? How to get rich? Meaning what of life? What is love? What is love? Oh, yeah. How to get rich? Meaning of life. Say that a lot because it seems to be popular. What, what is, is love? love? Baby, don't hurt me. Yeah. Don't hurt me no more. Pleasant feelings. All right. How much is that doggy in the window, Dad? You mean the one with the waggly tick? I said the waggly tick. Oh, oh, how much is that doggy in the window? Oh, oh, I do hope that doggies will see. I don't want a rabbit or a kitty. I don't want a parrot that talks. I want to do a pig. I don't want a boat of little fishes. I don't want no blow fishes. No, you can't take a goldfish for a walk. I say how um, much. She's a doggy. It'll be. We- I like the barnyard <laughs> animal <laughs> with a waggly, waggly tail. tail. Oh, is it the waggly tail? I said, how much is that doggy in the window? Oh, I do hope that doggies the same. Just let me do that window once more. <laughs> I thought I could get like a, <laughs> a window. <laughs> Do you think? Yeah, maybe one day. I'll work on it. I do like the barnyard animals, Mom. (laughs) Oh. Because if it is for sale, we're going to go get Roger Miller and we're going to go. What she said. We're going to go walking in the sunshine, sunshine, sing a little sunshine song. I pop you, pop you, oh, you got the bird smile upon your face. There's nothing wrong. I pop you. Bobby, oh boy, you got to think about a good time that you had a long time ago. Thinking about a good time, about your worries and your woes. Walking in the sunshine, singing the sunshine song. So you all go walking in the sunshine and sing a little sunshine song. Freak yourself out so bad that life is so bad it gets way better when you got to hit the gym for two hours a day. That's what you do. If you can make it 90 days, you probably make it. Now, keep the cards and letters coming in. We'll see you in the funny papers, and you all have a good one. <laughs>